Eurovision Review 2017. Latvia. Their song is called Line and it's performed by Triana Park and it's definitely the weirdest of the entries that I've reviewed so far and as such I applaud it. It's very different um, from the rest of this year's lineup. It stands out and I certainly applaud that but I'm thinking that in terms of audience appeal it's probably going to come off as a bit too weird. Um, of course I don't know how they're going to present it on stage in Kiev but uh, in their national contest they had lots of like neon graffiti and that type of thing and it kind of worked because that stage is quite small, was quite small uh, but obviously the international contest has a much bigger stage and I think if they tried to just transfer that it's going to be too much. Uh, people are going to be distracted and it's not going to work on the, a stage that size, is my opinion. Um, next thing I should say is um, negative for this entry and I don't want to I'm not saying this to offend anyone personally um, and of course you can change in the official video it's nothing like on the um, in the live version in their national contest but she just because of the way she's done her hair her outfit she just looks really weird really weird and I think quite possibly uh, too weird for a lot of people. If you remember Germany last year, their song wasn't necessarily half bad, uh, but the singer has uh, an extremely specific look and it did not go well down, go down well with the audience. And I think this might not either, but she isn't weird looking in and of herself, so if she chooses the right outfit and the sonography presentation is the right that can offset a lot of this and I hope that they don't go overboard because I think it's really nice to have at least some songs that stand out from the rest of the lineup and I think this is one of those songs it's a different genre from the other songs and I applaud that absolutely um, I don't think the song itself sounded very good it sounded quite disjointed and not very melodious in the um, uh, national final so it's a little hard to listen to, but the studio version sounds a lot better and uh, I can't say what it's going to sound like on stage in Kiev. Uh, I applaud the Latvians for sending something that stands out, uh, but it might stand out a bit too much to be able to really go that far, but uh, certainly I applaud them for being one of this year's risk takers, definitely. So kudos to Latvia for that. 